I'm recording now, so you know. For 60. <laughs> so for 60? Mm -hmm. And all on Amazon? Mm -hmm. Size 11. How long would it take to get here? I'm looking for boots for my new job. I'm making monies. Oh Hit the right knobby. Making them monies. <laughs> monies. I'm getting paid. No, not For you. services rendered. Not you. <laughs> Alright, well I got some chests I'm going to crack open. Um, what is today? The 8th? It'll be here July 11th. Nice. Not that, that sucks. I was got some really nice Thursday. loot from the chest. Well, I'll go check out Big Five in the morning first. Then you'll be, it'll be here Friday. Just so you know. Don't lick my leg. Philip, don't lick my leg. <laughs> I'm not licking your leg. Ew. Not yet. Or ever. Yeah, it's got some really sweet loot from a chest. I would explain it to you, but you wouldn't care or know what I'm talking about. Correct. If anybody watching this, that's, that's pretty fucking good. I gotta put the clothes in dry. All right, man. That's some good loot. That's some really good loot, actually. Yeah, speaking of emblems that um that popped up, I haven't been looking at my heroes. That 96 on him. So I need iron. But that's been the problem that I've had is all this stuff that I got going on. I can finally make harpoons. I'm trying to increase my iron capacity so I can up the level of this it's just man it's so much so much waiting I can't do anything else I can't create items I can't really level up my heroes that much I, mean, I suppose now is probably a good time to do it. I got a lot of food I don't know it's a conundrum I'm number five in my alliance I'm gonna take care of that Time to seven minutes. All right. So yeah, I did get a job. You know, I was unemployed for six weeks. I just get my unemployment or whatever, um, which is fine. I mean, it's nice. It's not enough. So I got a job. I like it. It's a warehouse, um, cold storage warehouse, which I knew there had to be a thing because products are made frozen, and they got to get somewhere else frozen, so they have to stay frozen along the entire path you can see this is my path one entire path so yeah um and there's a a very very cold area of the warehouse so i'm looking for insulated steel toe boots or our composito so i won't be freezing my ass off because it's negative 10 degrees all the time So that's pretty cool. It's union, good pay. It's. I'm pretty excited. I don't miss the old place. The old place can suck a day. So. We are officially out of dryer sheets. All right. So I think my defense on the red tournament this time, I put a little more thought into it. I mean, it's not bad. I still lost four times and won twice. But it's better than last time. Or, you know, lost 20 and won one.
How the rest of that show go? He's a dick. Chris Watts? Yeah. Mm-hmm. They don't really tell me anything I didn't already know since I've seen everything on there. It was kind of an odd scenario for me because I was appalled by what he did, but I didn't really have any desire to find out more about it. I just knew like what he was accused of and what he finally pled out to, and then when he explained exactly what happened, I mean, that's like man's pretty fucked up, dude. I have a problem with watching that kind of stuff. I watch it obsessively. Did he ever explain what led up to it? Yeah, he was uh she came home that night because they had it on ca- that's that is something i didn't know i didn't know they had her on video of her coming home at like two o'clock in the morning because she had just come back from a vacation with her friend or like a work thing and um <clears throat> and uh he was there and he had just got done spending time with that girl and um, he said, he legitimately said he had sex with her for a test to see if, like... He wanted to be with her? Yeah. And then he okay. woke up earlier that morning and told her that he wasn't in love with her anymore. And with the girlfriend? Wanted, no, okay. his wife. Okay, his wife, okay. And that he wanted a divorce, and she said, you will never see your kids again. Oh, no, she said, you're cheating on me. I knew you were, I knew there was someone else. And um, then he said, she said, he, she said, you'll never see your kids again. And I guess that pissed him off. And he jumped on top of her and started choking shit out of her. And then he looked over and saw his little girl watch, looking at him and the thing. And he said, what's wrong with, she said, what's wrong with mommy? And he said, no, she's just sick. She's not feeling well. So he knew that she saw her, him do that. So he got rid of his daughters too. So that's the part that I don't quite understand. I mean, I guess like him losing his cool and it being like a crime of passion. But then how could he like drive his kids to the site, get rid of the mom, and then kill his kids one at a time? He um, also said when he was telling it, he had no problem talking about killing his wife, but then when he said, they asked him about their, because he said, I really don't really want to talk about that. I mean, those were my babies, they were my whole life. I have a really hard time talking about that. Oh, but you don't have a hard time talking about killing your wife? That's okay, we can chit chat about that. I don't have a problem with that. But my kids, no, that's too much, it's going too far. But then he started talking about it. Like the whole thing was kind of fucked up, man. And the, the um, little girl, this he killed the first little girl. And then his five-year-old said, are you going to do to me what you did to whatever the other little girl's name, Cece? And uh, he said he doesn't remember what he said to her. He said he doesn't remember if he was cold and heartless and said yes, or if he said something else. And then he just took the blanket that he had already used to put over the other girl and choke her. That same blanket, he took it and put it over her. And when he was putting it over her, she said, no, daddy. And then he choked her. But he wasn't a very good, smart criminal. (laughs) He was a very smart murderer? Yes. Because... He used his work truck that has a GPS in it. Yeah, I did. Um, I did see that when the investigators were talking to him about it. What an idiot! And then he first said that his wife killed the two kids. And then he killed her at a only rate or whatever. Only after the only after the cops said, "Well, did you two get into an argument? Did she do something to the kids, and you got mad at her?" And he was like, ding! Yep, that's what happened. And he said he saw on the baby monitor, he said he saw on the baby monitor that his wife killed the kids, but 
that was a lie. Why would they have a baby monitor for a three and five year old unless they just bought it for the new baby? But she was only like a month pregnant. He already knew it was a boy, too. But they showed that, like, he had started saying things like he didn't want to have another kid, that two was enough, and all this and that. Like, it's kind of late for that. He was all kinds of fucked up. You were able to find out where he went, right? What do you mean where he went? Uh, for his prison sentence. Uh, they said it, and I meant to remember. They didn't say, like, when they said it, it didn't say it was like, whatever you said, something about maximum something or something something. I don't know what you said, but yeah, um, they just said the, the location. I'm pretty sure they do got, um... A supermax prison in Colorado. Like one of the main supermax prisons that we have. I'd imagine you would have gone there. I don't know. They um, said the name of it, but I didn't remember what it was. But I mean, they keep saying he annihilated his whole family. So I'm assuming they would want to put him in Max. He has no way of getting parole, and he's never ever getting out, so... Yeah, I know he's definitely gonna die in there. But... He still never showed any emotion. He didn't cry for his kids, he didn't cry for his wife. I feel bad for the girlfriend. Could you imagine? You didn't know any of this, and all of a sudden you see him on TV, and he's a suspect in the murder of his wife and kids. And then you find out he really did it, and then you watch him telling everybody how he did it, and you just was out on a date with this guy and you have pictures of you like canoodling with this guy it's fucking insanity I feel bad for her she said um well he seemed like a really nice guy they always do she, they said it's a classic case <laughs> this, this, no that's what no, she didn't say it but they said it's a classic case of the guy, the nice guy who um, is really calm and cool and collected when they, when they, uh, and calm, cool, collected, and kind of quiet. But then when they lash out, it's always big. They lose it. I was like, oh, fuck. My husband's going to kill me. No, I'm not. I'm not going to kill my wife because I'm not cool and collected and I'm not calm. You. <laughs> <laughs> yeah you are the calm quiet one I don't know about all that for the world to see they don't see that other side of you you only let a few people see that side of you you know, it's, oh he was always so nice you didn't show me that you were calm you, when we were dating you seemed cool and calm and collected well, no I did see you <laughs> 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 I, I, there was a red flag. A red what? A red flag? Yeah, there's always a red flag. You just have to decide whether or not you want to deal with it. See, you're welcome. I gave you a red flag. If I was a homicidal maniac with no feelings... Oh, I knew you were a homicidal maniac. I dated you 13 years ago. People change. People change. That's what I hoped. But when I saw the red flags, I realized you didn't. Homicidal maniac. <laughs> That's such a horrible. Like, people say that like it's a joke, but 
<laughs> That's not cool. <laughs> No, I'm not a homicidal maniac. I don't fake the funk. Yeah, you do. Lies. <sighs> I can't even hold my phone up, Mom. I'm so tired. That's embarrassing. <laughs> this is going up on the internet. All of 10 people are going to see me do that. That's embarrassing. Maybe 12. And one's name is Robert. And Steve and Billy. Are you giving him shout outs? Yeah, because only one. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Robert, Steve, and Billy tell him that. Well, embarrassing. Robert, Steve, and Billy are the same people. He has three accounts. Oh my God. Well, tell Robert, Steve, and Billy. Robert, Steve, Billy. We call him Silly Rob. To stop doing that anymore. Don't do that again. <laughs> please put it in the comment. Please never do that again. If you don't want to see me flex ever again, just leave a comment below. And I probably won't listen to it. Because I can't with good conscience keep the world from this. Ew, I can't. Please stop. I can't do that. Stop. <laughs> I'm not doing all that great. I'm not social either. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's a given. That's just good old classic Phil. Or Derek, as they know me. Phil or Derek doesn't matter. Do they know you as Phil? Um, I I think so. You know that's your name. Probably. Your your government name? Yeah, my government name. Not my street name. You didn't tell them my government name, did you? No, they not my wife. Then uh, um, they know what you look like. You on, know what I look like? Yeah, because online I got a picture of you and me at the Thanksgiving dinner. That's on there. I don't look like that anymore. So they know my wife is super hot. And they probably all are secretly wondering how the fuck I pulled that off. Still and that's when I pull out the guns. <laughs> I want to do it again. <laughs> it wasn't from the guns, so you guys know that. It was my fantastic personality. It wasn't that either. And my carrying hort. It wasn't. Definitely wasn't <laughs> that. <laughs> and the fact that I probably will not murder you. I mean, there's that, right? It's your ability to bullshit. I don't know if I should have done that. That was his way. His ability to bullshit. Eloquently. Eloquently. His eloquent bullshit is what got me. Mind you. I should brought regard. I did not realize he was bullshitting then. I'm pretty sure you had, um... A feeling, an idea, if you will. No, I did, and I believed you. Really? <laughs> yeah, I really did. I believe you. I'm, I'm not paying attention, and I'm seeing these teams I'm going up against. They got Wu on flank, doesn't make any sense, and Saprion in the wings. Which makes even less sense. I hope you're not even remotely trying to talk to me because all I hear is your blah blah blah. Wah wah wah. Wah wah wah. I might lose this though. Shit. Fuck! How's your game going?
I'm going to end it for the bunny on this game as soon as we have it. <laughs> <laughs> I know, because I'd spend money so many times already. Not a lot. Not thousands of dollars like somebody else I know. Who, Navi? Yeah, the dog. I figured it was him. You're blaming the Down Syndrome dog. The Down Syndrome dog is the one who's spending all the money on these mobile games. It's not me. I think that's fucked up and shows your, um... My what? Homicidal tendencies by blame. We have three dogs and you blame everything on the Down Syndrome one. That's the only one that makes sense. The rest can defend themselves. Or it's for your safety. You know what? I just realized that I keep losing. Because I didn't realize what my goal was. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I just lost this one. I shouldn't have, but I did. I'm not paying any attention. You okay? Uh, one more. No. So we're still having the thing on the um, 23rd? Are thereabouts? Have to get together here? I don't know. That's a little quick. We can still pull it off. All right, well, I mean, that'd be pretty terrible. But I'm okay with that. Ooh, shit, fire blade giant, huh?
That's it, 28. It's like trash. Bam. 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 God damn it. Oh well. I'll take it. 4.99. That's all. Any food? That was a little better. What do you think about eating?
Okay. So I'm still thinking about that that first shift mm -hmm. with the 4 a.m. start. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's usually why I'm going to bed. Mm -hmm. I'm still going to take it though. I'm not going to argue the point. I do think that'd be a good move. I've done that before. I mean, it's not like it's something that I've never done. You know, I used to build homes. You know, had to get up by the, you know, say before the sun came up to get to the site, and then prepare to start working. And you did it. Yeah, I did it. I did a fast and all. I mean, it's so not. You've only been doing it for three years, then, pretty much. Yeah, closer to four years. That's pretty much it. What it means is that for like two weeks, I'm, I'm gonna have to just get as much sleep as I can. Just still get up and go to work. And just keep doing that until I have no choice but to go to bed at the right time. Why are you so sore anyway? Off of your leg? Can you play and all that? The fact that I have a chronic pain disease probably. That might have something to do with it. Allegedly.
allegedly I have it. <laughs> <laughs> I know you have it. I forget because you handle it so well. Because you're a strong woman. I didn't try, I did. No, you didn't. With finesse. Because, again, finesse. that was a fine example of the bullshit. You see how believable it sounds? It sounds believable because it is. Believable. Wait. I don't think this is what I meant to say. I don't think it's a crock of bullshit. Hmm. That's pretty fucked up. That's pretty fucked up too. What's the name of the game you're playing now? I'm not telling. Don't worry. Tell the ten people. They gonna tell the ten people that watch this? Because that is in puzzles. It's not difficult and stuff. I mean, it is, but it isn't. The empires and puzzles really isn't all that difficult. It is. I'm good at it. No shit. And I'm pretty much retarded. Yes, I said that word. Yeah, don't say that. <laughs> you can't say that word. I can say that word because I am retarded. Bella! <laughs> now they know your government name. For sure. <laughs> For sure. What are you doing? You can't say that outside of this house. Scorch Vader. Yeah, it's kind of weird seeing Mother North, Burrito, and Gwen. And I'm not at all worried about it. I was going to use that green fuckface. Who? People. People? People. If I find me conceited? Yes. I, I don't see how. Or why they would. Got all these fucking bombs and no one. Nothing to do with them. They're just gonna blow up each other. Great. He's gonna fucking go off. And fuck up all my plans. How can all that happen and not a single goddamn purple show up? No, oh, Proteus. Oh, now you're saying it? No, I didn't say that. Wow. 
See what you made me do? Complete bad influence. Mm. I didn't realize I said it. Look how bad you are. on my health and well-being. God damn it! I shouldn't say things from Fuck. They just think we're a house full of potty mouths. <laughs> a house full of potty mouths. <laughs> Man, they didn't kill her, huh? The only thing about this is every once in a while shit freezes up, but it's only when you're trying to get bonus shit. You've been playing a long time. It'll freeze up. Boulder Dash. Boulder Dash. That's not a word I use too often. I do. God damn, this stupid... I almost said it, but I didn't. That's what you should say. <laughs> and I was gonna drop the C word on her. <laughs> Name's Masuko. She's giving me a hard time. I'm actually lose this match. Mother North about to go off again. Not a good idea to call somebody that I've been worried to either. What the C word? Yeah. No, it's probably not. I mean, it's just a character, but it's still a very nice thing to say. Oh man. <laughs> she keep <laughs> every time she brings Gwen back, that doesn't make any sense. Oh what am I gonna do here? Asshole. Well, that came in handy. Give me a purple. Nope. Another one. A purple? Okay, nope. Wait, yes. I'll take it. Okay. Any shit that'll help me in a moment. Not when it feels like it. <laughs> oh man, this is getting ridiculous. What is still going on? I need a purple hero bad. Real bad. Mmm. Ah. <sighs> And Gwen, every fucking time. Jesus Christ. I won, by the way. At the very beginning of the match, I said, I really don't fear him anymore. Meh, I really don't care. Like eight minute battle. Fuck.
That's better. I'm number one of my alliance again. I'm gonna hop down, I was number five. That is unacceptable. Those coins in that game as well. Guess coins make sense. No gems make sense. No, you pay with coins. The only reason why you're paying with gems then is because it's during another time period. This is okay. now. That's then. This is um current current currency. It is not current currency. What? Coins. Oh, gems. Yeah, gems are old currency. Right, that's what I was saying. Yeah. That's what I said. Mm -hmm. I was agreeing with you. But you said this is current currency. I'm sorry, I, I was referring to what you were talking about. Coins. Well, that's not really current currency. You can still use coins. You can give me four quarters, I'm good. Yeah, if you're a peasant. Don't give me stuff. <laughs> Man, I really want the Hero of the Month. You always want the Hero of the Month. Every month. Not always. There's been a couple. Where I was like, eh. I didn't even try. But I want this one. I got it last month at the very end. At the very last two polls that I did. On the last day. But I'm going to wait... I know. Don't have a choice. I got the gems now, but if I do it now, then I, I miss out on the event coming up. And I want to try for that too. So. I got to practice little self restraint. When I really want to do something, but I don't, because it makes more sense to wait, so I control myself. You know how to do that. Yes, I do. Really? I wanted to buy the hundred dollar, um, the one hundred dollar bundle they had at the second, the last offer. And I checked everything to make absolute certain that it could not do it. <laughs> and then when I realized that this is no feasible way, unless I go whore myself. But if you would have found something. If I if, if I would've found have if I would have found some way that was legitimate that didn't involve me whoring myself. Like whoring me. I wouldn't have whored you neither, or the dogs. Or our kids, I wouldn't have done any of that. I just wouldn't have done it. And I didn't. Because I couldn't make it happen. I don't know why you didn't whore out the kids. They'd have done it themselves. They would have wanted a cut. That's right, that's right. I shouldn't give them any money. And that's where murder comes in. <laughs> that's where sex crimes come in, too. Oh, there's that. That's that's pretty serious. There's um, I don't know this, and I don't. Kenny, Kenny something. He's like a billionaire that got charged with sex trafficking, and it goes back pretty far, where he had a pretty sweet deal. I'm not remembering it very well, but he did like 13 months in jail, and most of that on work release. Hey, you're on my pillow. Rather serious crimes. And it's the same as R. Kelly. Like, he had a group of people that helped him do it. And so I think now what they're trying to figure out is... I, they, he had how a group they, people that helped him do it. And they kind of knowingly, unknowingly did mm -hmm. it. In this case... 
in that case, because they're fucking lying out their asses, they knew exactly what the fuck they were doing. In this case, with this guy, it's pretty fucking obvious. There's no way they can be like, I didn't know. I just thought he really liked being around underage girls. It's pretty obvious. And they're doing it because they're getting paid. Yeah, so it's, you know. Let's gotta look into it. I'm pretty sure it's a wrap for the guy. That's some money. Like, we're watching the thing on Colts about the, um, what was that church called? Word church of God? Of hell. Like, Word of God Church or whatever the fuck it was. And how they're trying to expose what was happening there. And it was up the DA, which is why the DAs have too much power, because they decide who gets fucking prosecuted by themselves. I know some which places. Makes no fucking sense because they're humans and they can decide. Well, they're biased. That's my homie. I know some places um, use a grand jury to um, decide if they're going to indict somebody or not. They and should I, always use a grand jury. I think that's jury. a much better idea. You know, but, but it's like, why are they deciding not to prosecute it? Too. You know, but, yeah, but that's more difficult. Where's just one person? Like, yeah, we're just we're not going to prosecute. Oh, we are. It's going to be a much, much smaller crime. And you're like, why? Like, oh, because you're in their pocket. Right. Are you so incredibly biased? It's fucking ridiculous. All right, well, I guess that's everything. So, what was that guy's name? I don't know. Alright, well, I guess that's that. <laughs> I'm gonna call it a wrap. Everybody take care. Catch you later.